These images show the completed missile and space facility in North Korea. The satellite images were taken over the past month. Tim Brown, an image analyst who is a senior fellow at globalsecurity.org, says it has taken North Korea about a decade to finish the facility. We can now say, I think confidently, that the, uh, the launch tower and the, uh, the launch pad are basically finished. And the question is, do they have a launch vehicle that's ready to be launched? And we just don't know. Brown and a colleague in 2008 first spotted the facility under construction at the time and were the first to publicly reveal it. Brown says it is a more advanced operation than North Korea's first launch site because it has a rocket engine test stand, missile assembly and test buildings, a launch bunker, and an observation tower. Compared to the old site, which was nothing more than a, uh, uh, a place they go when the, when the weather was right to just launch their missiles, this is actually a dedicated launch center. Daniel Pinkston, the senior analyst in Seoul for the International Crisis Group, says the facility is a major step in North Korea's quest for an intercontinental ballistic missile capable of striking the United States. They're basically inseparable. If you have uh, a space launch uh, capability, you can turn that into an ICBM relatively um, easily at that point. U.S. Defense Secretary Robert Gates warned last month that North Korea within five years will have the capability to strike North America with a missile. Pyongyang has tested two nuclear weapons and says it has turned some of its stockpile of plutonium into bomb material. There are concerns that it aims to create a nuclear bomb that can be carried on a missile. North Korea has never publicly referred to the new launch site. That may change as leader Kim Jong-il prepares to turn over the country to his son Kim Jong-un. Impoverished North Korea has vowed to become a strong and prosperous country by next year. Some regional analysts say part of that campaign could include another attempt to launch a three-stage missile. Previous attempts have failed. Pyongyang is already under heavy sanctions by the international community and cut off from any significant international trade except with China. So it is unclear what more the South Korean and U.S. governments can do if there is as many experts anticipate, another North Korean missile launch or a third nuclear test. Steve Herman, VOA News, Seoul.